Hi guys, it's Amanda. Welcome back. I'm going to attempt to do the weekly oracle card reading video. I tried this earlier and whenever I went to edit, I realized there was no sound. So I forgot to turn the sound on. Oops. It was a message all about being scattered and trying to follow through on one thing and completing one thing before you start something new. And that's been like a theme of my life most of my life. I have a really hard time focusing on something from beginning to end. I get distracted very easily and I have a hard time finishing things and it really stresses me out sometimes. But anyway, I guess that message was for me and me alone. So I will try again to do the weekly oracle card reading video. I will try again with the Goddess Power Oracle by Colette Baron reed I want to use the Simple Guidance Daily One Card Pull. I really like this card, even if it's not for a day. I like it for these... Sorry. That was the timer. My oven is preheated. But I'll worry about that later. I like these for one day, um, to focus on it for a day. But I really like these for the weekly readings also, because... It gives us something to focus on every day over the next week to kind of dig deeper into any issues we may encounter with the subject of the card. So we'll click on it and see what we get. Not exactly sure if I'm going to pronounce this correctly, but I'm going to say Leitzi. I have no idea. Leitzi. Revelation. Empowerment message. There are moments when synchronicity brings all the elements together for a flash insight to rise up in you in a glorious epiphany. Whatever was not clear becomes crystalline in an instant. It's as if you are able to simultaneously perceive every facet in a diamond. You know without a doubt that you are on the right track as deep understanding sinks into your very soul. In this moment, change and transformation takes place, and a transcendent moment is offered to you as an extraordinary gift. Now is one of those times. The Chinese goddess Lei Tzu, mother of lightning, brings revelations into your life with a flash. She gifts you. This is as a result of all the hard work you have put in to dismantling your old self and making space for who you want to become. This is a very auspicious time. Okay, so this is a really good message. The last few weeks we've been getting messages about things changing, going along with things, waiting for the difficulty to, waiting for the cycle of difficulty to complete so that something new and better can come. And so this card is telling us that our time has come, like a lot of the difficulty is going to be over soon. And the things that we've been working for or striving for are going to be coming into realization for us very soon. And for the week, I like to ask you to do a meditation on the messages from the card or a meditation with your spirit guides or have a moment in prayer with your God or goddess or the universe or whatever divine energy that you work with and if you don't work with any divine energy, maybe it's your higher self that you work with. Um, whatever it is, I want you to, I ask you every week for this to take time in prayer or meditation or reflection as you go to sleep or as you take a bath or take a shower or do something. Whatever kind of moment that you take for yourself that you kind of just go inward and reflect I, I ask you to take that reflection on the message from this card every day over the next week 
And with this one, I want you to take that time and ask your spirit guides how to be ready to accept or receive or utilize the new blessings that you are about to receive. Ask them how to be open to working with the new positivity that is coming to you after you have suffered through the discomfort over the past few weeks. And I hope that you receive some messages about how to be open and ready to accept the new bright things that are coming because this card tells us that the difficult the, the cycle of difficulty or the cycle of conflict in your life is going to be almost over or it's just about to be over or maybe it is over maybe things are starting to look up and I want you to work with your divine energy to accept and work with this new positivity this new cycle of positivity this new cycle of blessings and abundance that's coming with you I want you to be able to fully appreciate all of the goodness that is coming and that's all that I have for this week so I thank you as always for watching please like subscribe and share my videos with anyone who you think may be interested and have a blessed day bye